Hello, and welcome to this quick introduction to ClickData i4. In this video, we will cover the three basics of how ClickData allows you to create live and powerful dashboards for your company in a few simple steps. Step one is about connecting your data source to the application. To do so, click on the Add Data button. Then select Add New Connection. If you are working with any Excel files from your computer, you can just drag and drop them into this screen as well. From the list, select the type of connection you want to create in ClickData. In this example, the data source is an Excel sheet located on my company Dropbox account. Once you have authorized your Dropbox account to connect with ClickData, simply select your data source from the list and click Next. Make sure your data is correct, and again, click Next. ClickData will now import your data to the application. Once the process is complete, open the dashboard by clicking on the icon located on the top menu bar. Then select Create Dashboard. Give it a name, a description, and if needed, you can also change the theme, the color scheme, and other options as well. Once you are done setting up your dashboard, click Create. And now you are ready for step two, building your first dashboard. Start by dragging and dropping widgets from the toolbox directly onto the dashboard. In this example, we will be using a column chart. First, give it a name and set your color preferences. Then select the data icon to bind your widget to your data source. Select your data source and from the list of columns present, drag and drop your categories and values to populate the chart. In this example, we will analyze the history of the quantity of cars sold over time by putting the column quantity into values and the column years into categories. If you are satisfied by the preview, click on the format icon and you can further customize your chart. Once you are done, click save. Congratulations, you have just built your first widget with click data. Don't forget to save your dashboard using the icon in the top right corner to make sure it will still be there the next time you connect. And now it's time to look at the third and last step, sharing your dashboard. To do so, the easiest way would be to make it available through a live link. Select the property icon and click live link. Enable the feature and copy the link located on the right part of the screen. Click save. Let's open a new tab in our web browser and paste the link we've just created. Voila! You can send the link to your friends and colleagues to let them know about the dashboard you've just created. And there you are. If you need any more help, feel free to contact us at support at clickdata.com or via our Twitter channel at clickdata. Thank you very much and happy dashboarding.